Hey comic book fans, welcome back to Comic Book Corner 2.0 and guys you're with me, Mike Spider Slayer. That's right guys, getting ready to do another comic book review. And today we're going to be talking about Superior Carnage issue number three. It's just not a good week for Spider-Man fans and it's taking me a lot to not go crazy on this one. Um, the story is not bad here, though. Uh, however, what happens to Carnage is almost heartbreaking in a way. Now, will the character stay the way that he is right now? I hope not. And I'll tell you why. So there will be some spoilers here, okay? And the only reason why is I have to get your people's reactions on this and see if you understand where I'm coming from with this. Okay? All right. So we're on part three of this issue on this uh, story arc. And we obviously know that uh, the wizard is trying to get his Frightful Four team together. And he's been trying to uh, take over the mind of the symbiote Carnage over Cletus, Cletus Cassidy. But he's been lobotomized, and there's no way to control his mind. So what happens in this issue, uh, we saw at the end of the last issue, is that we get to see uh, a surgeon by the name of Carl Maltz, who was joining the Frightful Four. But then what happens is they wind up using him to transfer the symbiote over to his body. So the wizard can actually take him over. And we get to see this here. And you see his narration in the book. Uh, which was pretty good to see, you know, he was like, oh, my name is what was so and so, and this is what happened. And then what happens is the symbiote makes this complete transfer here, and you can see it taking over. And you're like, well, well that's pretty cool, you know, the symbiote's got a new host. And as the issue opens up, you get to see the symbiote the, pretty much the same way as it's been. Um, it's not completely used to the host yet. So it's acting the same way that it's always had because the only host that it's ever had was Cletus Cassidy. Um, you get to see some uh, nice artwork in this issue. Uh, you get to see, uh, you know, the wizard and the claw doing battle with it. And then what happens is the wizard winds up getting uh, control of the symbiote. And they wind up going on this mission and they want to take over the mayor's office. But... What happens once the symbiote gains, once the wizard gains control, um, he tells the symbiote or the actual host, which is which is the doctor, um, Doctor Carl, is you know straighten up. And now that the symbiote has a smart host, the symbiote is a little bit more smarter as well. So you get to see that here, and he forms into Superior Carnage which is this what the hell is that seriously what's going on what is going on in the spider-man universe like what's happening i what is this this is not carnage this is atrocities that's what it looks like it looks just like him it's like okay so he tells him, you know, I want you to get on some clothes. So he winds up now wearing like this cloak and he has machine guns and it's like he's wearing this straight jacket because the symbiote forms clothes now too. Like th listen, Venom. Venom and Carnage now form clothes as a symbiote and now he carries guns. So he's like the Punisher Carnage. Like, okay. But besides this, the story was actually halfway decent. You kind of feel for the wizard here. He wants to prove to his son that he is somebody. And he has like this dementia, like Alzheimer's type of thing, where he's seeing things. He doesn't know where he's at at some times. And the claw kind of really sets him straight here. Um, and he does get a hold of the mayor's office. And by the time that the issue happens... Uh, we get to see that the wizard breaks in and um, 
Carnage breaks in and you think that he's going to take over the office. Well, meanwhile, Superior is waiting for him. My favorite guy right now. Why does Carnage look like a freaking robot on Atrocitus slash Punisher? Like, I, I just don't get it. Like, I understand it's a more um, smarter symbiote. You know, and in the way he talks, in the issue, is the same way. He's much more smarter. He's like, ooh, that fool Cletus. He's like, if he only spent a little time with a little bit more focus, I could turn out this way. And it's like, the, the thing's got a brain now. And it's only being controlled by the wizard. Will it stay this way? I hope not. I really don't like the way it looks. And based off of the cover of the next issue, it looks like maybe the wizard loses its control. And you would hope that the symbiote kind of looks like this again. So I don't know. But God, Lord, help me. Please, please do not ruin Carnage 2. This is not Carnage. I don't care. I understand characters need development they need to change every once in a while uh but cletus was dead for a long time and we didn't see carnage and we recently got him back and the way that he is is that crazy uncontrollable symbiote that can only have a host of cletus it's, it's just the way it is it's always been that way and to make him into this it's just i i don't like it okay i i just don't and please marvel please keep them like this I, i'm begging you because if i read the next issue of this and he's still the same way you will see another rant on this channel i could not do two rants in one week that would just be ridiculous and it all has to do with my favorite universe the spider universe you guys are driving me crazy between this Superior Spider-Man and freaking Venom being canceled and freaking Scarlet Spider being canceled. It freaking tells you something. Shit's not going right over there. All right, guys. So get your shit together. And I'm just going to stop now because I'm starting to get angry. So as an overall story, this is a three out of five. It's average. If, again, Carnage stayed the way, it probably would have been a little bit better. But he's not. He's different now. He's smart. He looks like Atrocitus mixed with the Punisher. So you guys tell me your thoughts on this book. Till the next comic book review, this is Mike Spider Slayer signing off. I'll see you guys real soon. Thanks for watching, everyone.